Good. He just kind of feels like, you know what? A marriage didn't work out. Yeah. There's a divorce that took place. And now I'm meeting this woman where she is right now. I vetted and Robin differently it. than that. I yeah. vetted Robin hard because I had to know that she didn't leave a good man before I was going to marry her and take a chance with that. Y'all, Cody is letting it be known that David, because he did not vet Christine long enough to make sure that she didn't leave a good man because he's a good man. And I made sure that I vetted Robin to make sure she didn't leave a good man because it was not going to work if she did leave a good man. My brain cells are fried talking about Cody. But let's go ahead. It's very <laughs> me and my daughter like subscribe and comment down below, you all, because mm -mm -mm -mm. I feel like Cody is personally, I feel mm -hmm. he is trying to rationalize how somebody could actually go and be with Christine. Either he feels like one, she's not good enough of a person, or two, I think he is just trying to justify the really effed up thing he said talking about how christine would never find somebody last reunion she was single this reunion she's getting married that is a huge ass pillow a pill to swallow like you just might choke on you it and end up six feet under what happened with narcissists though right you know they what I mean? when you when you leave them well when you leave them they really prefer if, if they can leave you if they know for sure you're going oh yeah for sure but he knew, and, and like I don't she think, said it. And I really don't think that polygamist, listen, it's not really something that I, I am in. Not, no, it's not, the, I'm not in. That's how that very, it is how certain, it's not something I'm not really in as if. We're not I into it at all. Yeah, we don't not. believe the first, second, third, fourth wife, we will never be that. <laughs> yeah, but <laughs> it's either that I was stuttering or that, it's if I'm in it, I'm not, I'm truly okay, I never have been. All right, but. It just seems to me that Cody, is, and I think in the polygamy world, I think that when the wife leaves the husband, you know how they shun her. The whole community shuns her, right? They don't expect that woman to really find somebody. You know, like Christine's mom. I don't know if she has found anybody. You know, She's they don't really good. expect that. They they think that she, you know, they're gonna be out there forever right not really belonging to any world anymore they're going to be pathetic you dare to leave me right I, I should be the god in your life that's the man and you dare to leave me so because you left me you're going to have nothing not only do you not have the children you don't get the camaraderie of this family anymore you're just out there right and that's what he expected for christine right okay to the point that he was even like, and he really didn't want her going anywhere. He yeah. wanted her to really sit there because he had recognized in Robin also that Robin needed these wives to be around yeah. and to be looking jealous and to be looking confused and to be looking all blotchy and unhealthy like Mary and, 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 Mary were, like Mary and Christine were looking like. Yeah. You know, he recognized that Robin also needed that. So he was going to keep Christine there, even if Christine was there with a man in the same bedroom, like down the road. Like some the, crazy on the same stuff. property. Look, 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 what look, real look. adults do is that they get married, they bring the person on the property. That's what adults do because we're a family. What who adult does that? I, I don't know. Who does that? Some odd people. If, some, if Christine had requested that of you, you probably would have laughed in her face. Well, remember when Mary was saying that in one anniversary? Yeah. Like, how would you like it if I had somebody? He's like, that's disgusting. How that's dare disgusting. you say that? <laughs> what are you got your little polygamy going on over here? Well, there goes a double standard. Yeah, so it's just been double standard. And then the other thing, too, I think with Cody, too. First of all, you knew that Rob, Robin had already insinuated all kinds of things about that husband. So you knew he wasn't a good man, right? Because even Mike Kelty is saying that, you know, Robin's father, the, the oh, children's gonna... father was so awful and blah, blah, blah. So you knew the guy was not a good, good man per Robin. So you knew she didn't leave a good man. So what in the hell are you talking about now, Cody? That Christine has to make you bad because no man will, no man will have Christine. He like just, she's not a phenomenal woman on her own. No, she doesn't have to bad mouth you for stunned. anybody to go and be with he's her. He's just stunned that David, who is actually a decent man, is decent looking, got some money, um, has a family that, 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 that appears to like him, and so, so married her so, so quick exactly and so he's looking at all that and he's like if he's booked david is even more than he is 
because David is richer than Cody, right? Not just with financially, right? And he didn't because have to at use least he's four okay women. financially. He has his own business. Yeah. But yeah, he didn't have to use four women to get there. Well, and three because Robin didn't do a damn thing. Anyway, and then on top of that, the kids actually appear to like him, so he's rich in family, rich in money, rich in love. And um, now he also has Christy. It's just that's the type of heart that go bon, it go oh, bon. Yeah. And for all the women who are out here, who that has not happened to them yet, we are loving it. We are thoroughly enjoying this Christine moment. Yeah, and it happened so quick, so quick. Yeah, yo. And and he's talking about how he vetted Robin. Like I, I really. Vetted her. Can someone tell me how long they <laughs> they dated? Well, it was an, a year and a half, I think, or it was. Wasn't months. that because of the show? Because they wanted to do the wedding, and so they wanted to kind of drag it out. If the show wasn't there, they probably would have been married, or you know, yeah, you know. So because they had to show the dating and all that stuff. So yeah, you know, something, Cody. I don't know. So, I've heard the term "kick rocks." Does that mean like he has to suck it up? You just gotta kick rocks then. That's what it means. Yeah, basically. Anywho, but yes, yo. But we're enjoying it. I am thoroughly enjo- enjoying it. Did you just love it when Suki was like, "Can we just? This is just a girlfriend question." The whole thing is so juicy. I thought just Suki like, did a much better job than she did last year. That's I actually do believe. I believe she did a great job. She really better did. than what she did last year. Last year it seemed like she was a deer in headlights. She didn't know anything. Yeah. But this year it seemed like she really did ask a question. She wasn't yeah. trying to really let him off. Yeah. But I think she did a good balance because if you're interviewing somebody like Cody, it's very easy for him to get triggered and be like a little petulant child and walk about yes. the room yes. because you dare to ask him um, yeah. the truth about his contradiction. She has, yeah, she has bad mind me to date. She has bad mind me to date. And, and, and Suki was like, like he but, did you know, it. He actually think he's a good guy. Yeah, so, he doesn't really think that of you. He's like, oh, really? Oh, really? About you. No, yeah. he doesn't. He ain't think about you that much. Yeah. I mean, he just realizes that the relationship just didn't work, and now it's over. And she has moved on. They're getting married. You have your favorite wife. You have your soulmate. And he's really trying to tell you, move on. So I'm happy that Suki really let me know that. So that was awesome. Yes, y'all. But it's Mary. And I'm a- you want you guys to like, subscribe, and comment down below. Bye. Bye.